Welcome back, this is Drasner, doing some more exploration of Navgen. Uh, today we're going to look quickly at the diner. I just want to show you one thing that for some reason everybody seems to look. Of course, check the roof, go through the window. And then one thing that people forget sometimes, these round corners are cabinets looped in. Everything else in there is fairly self-explanatory. If you need help with that, please ask. But the only reason I stopped here is mainly because we got this lovely feature over here. Don't forget to check the roof and so forth of all buildings. Uh, over here we got a mine. And this canyon mine is going to be one place we're going to explore. Um, that house over there is worth looting, but um, the canyon mine is actually pretty cool. Let me go ahead and speed up a little bit. Alright. So over here you got the lovely mine, this is where things come up, a conveyor belt. This conveyor belt is your key to everything. So we can come in over here, see there's some loot in there so don't forget to check that out. Or we can go through the front door. The front door is going to take you a little bit of time. So. Because of the fact that what we're wanting to explore is over here, I'm just going to go in this way. Try and be strategic about your entry points, 200 points, where I have metal if I do the other way. You can come in here, just move back here, got a bob up there you can get. Oh, let's go on the other side. You got a workbench you can steal away. And through here, if you saw, I think it's this wall, right? Oh, back here. That's where we came in. And over here, through this wall in here, is another crate. So the easiest way is probably can come in through here. So look through here and see this grate. So you get a working stiff grate. All right, let's go back inside. It's getting a little dark. Let me go light the place up. This conveyor belt. What's so special about it? It goes on and on. Well, take this out, and guess what? It does go on and on. Now, there's two ways you can go ahead and open this up. This is going to take a little while. 3,000 points. Or, this is 300. So, I'd almost recommend going this way. You get a little scrap metal out of it. You could dig a hole down through the dirt to the side. But hopefully you already have a... Uh, it's going to be another 300 for this one. That's weird. And you can see way down there how far it goes down. So, again, I could go through the dirt on the side. Be careful, the drop's fairly steep. There's a hidden body. So make sure you chalk around. That's always where you're going to have to find loot. So up there. So easy way to get over there. Bam, bam. And we lose this guy of his hidden loot. Hopefully you have a better quality Joe than I do by the time you're here. Just keep going down the belt. Keep your eye out for loot. And you got a huge mine down here to explore. I'm not going to explore it all for you because I want to make it a little exciting for you guys. But it is huge. It goes on and on. And on and on. So go down and enjoy it and find all the lovely loot. <coughs> Alright. This is the hidden mine. You never know what you can find. So explore around. Look at that easy iron. That's funny. So this is actually one of the few places with set um, 
resources that are easy to find and know where they are. So if you want to gather some iron, there you go. And your tunnel goes around. And don't forget to explore all sides. It is huge. I'm going to just go outside just a second and show you how big it is. All the way down there. And it comes out into the, the dungeon outside. So, and you got a little balcony here. So, explore the huge place. It's huge underground. And I'll let you explore that for yourself. Alright. If you guys enjoyed this hidden location and all this loot, please mash that like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. And while we're at it, let's take out a water tower. Have some fun. Structural integrity! Yay! Alright. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please smash the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. And we'll continue our tour of the Navjan world and the hidden loot and locations.